everybody, it's Michelle with Comfy Cozy Living. Today I have a Goodwill haul for you. Now, it was not a Goodwill haul that I was planning on, but <laughs> things just kind of happened. So it was on Saturday that um, Tammy and I kicked off the uh, church and community rummage sale season um, of our part by, uh, you know, hitting it on Saturday. And, um, after I dropped her off, which was quite early, mind you, we got home and done by, oh, golly, I don't even know what time it was, but it was early. And, um, I mean, it might've been noon. I don't even know. And, um, I thought, well, you know what? I haven't been to Men Menominee Falls um, Goodwill in a while. Let me let me just check it out. So, you know, uh, spoiler alert. <laughs> I didn't plan on uh, spending a ton of money because I just really wanted to go with just my cash that I had left. But then I kept finding stuff and it was it was like good stuff you know and uh and then I was like okay if I end up with a few more things at this point I'm gonna I'm gonna look at it like I'm using my birthday discount and uh again like I said spoiler alert it happened <laughs> my total came to $92 I think and then I got my 25% off for my birthday. And you can only use it once in your birthday month. And I used it. Um, now, the funny thing was that <laughs> I don't know if my friend Sam watches this. But <laughs> I saw her when I was going in. And she had three things. Three things. My hurt, hand hurts. I can't do that. Three things in her hand. Um, one of which I totally would have gotten if I had seen it. It looked like a um like a treasure craft um a, a, a ashtray, but it was actually like a probably USA pottery. Um just a little dish, but it was super cute. But anyhow she's like this is all I found and I'm like I was gonna text her and say, yeah this is what I found <laughs> but um anyway here we go. And in no particular order of course. Um, but this was, I think, the first thing I found. I happened to look up, because this wouldn't normally be in the section that I that I found it in. This was actually in, it was like, they, they this one doesn't have great, great um, linens ever. But the below the, the linens and above the linens are always like, um, you know, crates and the plastic organizational you know, Dollar Tree bins and, and things and totes and whatnot. And this was on the shelf up top. And so I was like, oh, I'm glad I looked up. So it's it's really cute. And um, I mean, I don't know what's the size of this. It's uh, um, like eight and a half long by like five and a half by like five and a half so anyhow i think it's super cute and i'd easily be able to sell it on you know to one of you guys because i have shipped way bigger things so anyhow i put something in there for safekeeping um well this is the weirdest kind of rubber band i've ever seen look at that weird so no, oh, now this has a little smell, but anyhow, yeah, and that's how it goes. And um, this was a like I wished these weren't there and this wasn't there, but then I thought, you know what? Whoever uses it could um, see. I can almost do it with my hand. You can push them in, so you could use something to push them in and push them down or whatever, or maybe like get like use a little saw thing to get them off, but. Anyhow, it's very cute. And there that is. So. 
Um, so this is what I was keeping in there. Um, they had a ton of Avon, which wasn't the only reason that I did the birthday discount, but it was probably the turning, the tip, it did have a lot to do with it. Um, because they had them in a lot of different sections because they don't know what they're doing. And so, um, I, every section I saw them in, I looked at them, right? This one did not have its box or it probably did, but not where I found it. Cause I didn't find it by the, uh, it just, like I said, they put it in all these different places. So, um, anyhow, this one is to a wild rose beauty dust, but I just, I wanted it. And it's brand new. It's brand new. Like the, the powder is, it hasn't even been like that paper is over the powder. And then this is perfect. And this, so I know exactly what I would do with that. So yeah. Uh, let me put this up here for not to lift it up. So, and then there's this one, um, which I'm not going to try to do them all, but I can't help it. When things are right here, I can't help it. Um, and the prices for these Avons were all over the place. Like that thing was $2.99. This one was $99. So but most of them were $1.99 and $2.99, I think, but I don't know. Anyhow, so this one didn't have a box or anything, but I, um, I have had different ones of these and I have sold them always. And so I thought I had bought one that I had bought to keep, but I wasn't positive. So since it was, I mean, since I had my discount thing, anyhow, that I was going to use and, um, you know, it was a good price. Anyhow, I thought, let me get it. And then I, it see, it still has its stuff in it from the cream sachet. I, they had so many cream sachets with the stuff in it and they had so many pretty ones. Oh, some of them are in a big whoop, but some of them are so pretty. And I'm like, I cannot go down that rabbit hole because I, I used to sell, or I used to, well, I sold it too, but I collected those Avon decanters and I have had, I had like 13 boxes full of them when I finally sold them. So I can't, can't, I don't need all of those. And I don't want them. I buy it for a certain decor that I know I will go with. Um, like I, like I collect certain Christmas ones, probably most of those Christmas ones. Anyhow, here's a piece of weeping gold. I believe it does say, um, 24 karat gold made in USA. And it was at FW Woolworth. I love it that there was a sticker and it looks like it was 98 cents. <laughs> Can you even imagine? Golly, can you even imagine? It's so pretty though. It looks like a, like a, a rose, like it goes up and then it's a rose right here. So anyhow, pretty, pretty vase. Okay. I bought this. I feel like I get you guys, like I'll get something and you guys are, oh, I wish it was this, this, or this. So I'm going to still every now and then buy Zodiac stuff. Um, plus this one was made in Japan. So, um, yeah, I got Leo and it says one cool cat. <laughs> My aunt, it says July 23rd to August 22nd or 23rd. And my aunt is the July 23rd and my mom is... August 2nd, so they're both Leo. Now, let me tell you. For anybody that has ever dissed my Avon, may you find it in your hearts to apologize. Because this is the cuteness that you cannot deny. It is a candle, an Avon mushroom candle. Mm-hmm, yeah, sure is. 
You saw it. Cute, cute. So cute. Mm hmm. Yeah. So, forward all your uh, apologies to Comfy Cozy Living. <laughs> I'm only kidding, kind of. Because <laughs> I know a lot of people just like hate on it. Some people are just like, eh. But some people really hate on it. And I'm like, geez. But, um, and the box is adorable even. So. Mm-hmm. Yvonne Enchanted Mushroom Meadow Morn Fragrance Candle. Okay. Now, I hope my girl Dolly is watching. Because... I wasn't going to get these. And then I was like, wait a minute. Are those a certain shade of not white? And sure enough, they were Lennox. Salt and pepper. Now, she might have these already, but yeah, still. Um... I don't know what else that says in there on on the the little stamp I mean I know it says Lennox and I know that's an L but I think it's just like these flourishes so I don't think it says anything else but salt and pepper yeah so I got those then um I, I wouldn't have gotten, I, I, there's no way I would get all the perfume talcs because I don't, I mean, they're just bottles of perfume talc, which is not even good for you. Um, but first of all, I would not have gotten it just because of the box either. Cause I'm going to put the box away, but I got this one because look at that. It's the Hawaiian white ginger and look at that. That is so cute. I had to get it for the colors. That is gorgeous. So, there you go. Um, and uh, it just says Avon Perfume Talc. And it's so funny that it didn't say anything else on it. Like the, the actual scent. But that's how some things were, you know. Some things just... I don't know. But uh, this one... Now, certain things that Avon did, they did in two different sizes. They would do it like in a mini mini, and then they would do it in like a regular kind of a size. And so this is called a pineapple petite, but this is, this is not the small one. They have a smaller one, I believe, if I remember correctly. But anyhow, so this is the pineapple um, brocade. I'm not gonna, it's not an hour that I want to have that smell in my nose right now. But, um, so anyhow, and then it also has that on it. So these things were kept really well. I mean, like, I don't know, somebody was a good collector. But it's a pretty box, too. And it's the um, Pineapple Petite Brocade Cologne. Now these, I do, I... I started to collect them because I think I sold one and then I regretted it because I was like, oh, that was really pretty. And then after I got one again, I kept it. And then I was like, okay, I'm going to kind of collect these. These are per perfume talcs, but they're in these cans. They're so cute. And it does say, um, it does have the good housekeeping seal of approval. <laughs> so there it is. And they're just pretty. I mean, they're just so pretty. This is by, uh, this is Topaz. So, I don't, none of these were my scent back in the day. Well, no, Hawaiian White Ginger, when I was a little girl, I had a little bottle. I liked it. So, that. This is not an Avon. <laughs> um, this was from Midwest Importers, which, um, was, you know, is like a wholesale, or not, what's the word? You know, like there's creative co-op and there's like some of these brands that sell wholesale to retailers or whoever. And, um, this was made in the Philippines, but, um, it's so cute. I know somebody's going to love it. Little chonky rounded kitty kitty. Yeah. 
That was a no-brainer. So he sets this in something else that's wrapped. How is that going to protect it if it falls out? This, when I looked at it, I was like, oh, that looks like a wade. But um, it doesn't have any kind of markings. So um, I believe it's a toothpick holder. A little schoolhouse, maybe, or a little barn and side door thing. I don't know. So I thought that was cute, but it, to me it looked like a Wade Whimsy kind of thing. But if if it doesn't say it on there, I don't really think it is. So I'll have to, you know, do a search on it. Um, now I don't like. I'm trying to not buy every Starbucks thing I find. And I did good that day because I saw some at um, I saw some at the church rummage, even the first one we were at, and I saw some at other rummage sales and all that. But I didn't get any. But I did get this one because, well, it's um, I don't even think it has a year. No, but it's plain for the most part. Just says Starbucks. I like the shape, and it's just. It's just red. Look at the handle, the way it goes down instead of up. But I, I like this. So I thought, yeah, I'll get that. Some people like that it's not like completely ornamented. Then you can kind of use it all year, you know? Like, I don't care if it is ornamented. So, <laughs> so this I happen to love, but... I don't remember what colors I have. Now see this coming Christmas season, I'll be you you know, I'll be de decorating. Oh man. And so I will have to um take a look like make a list probably of Oh man. I can't take this off right now or ever maybe. It is taking the color off. Oh, I don't want that to happen. So anyhow, this is, actually that smells pretty good, but I can't tell you what it is because I'm not going to pull the tag off. It was a bath oil, but I love this one. And there's a different, I think they have red and silver also. So see, I can't remember which ones I have or if I sold them for that matter. This. This is so, so sweet. And I haven't decided if I'm keeping it or selling it. Um, I'm probably going to keep it for a while, at least. And I think it is an ashtray. But I'm going to use it, you know, like for rings or something. It's, it's, I, I'm, I feel like I, I'll have, I'll know what, exactly what I'll need it for when I am going through my, like, you know, getting stuff ready for living. This is, you know, how the 80s are back. Well, this is, this is an 80s vibe for sure. And also, um, when I first saw the tag, like, I didn't see it up close when I turned it over. And, um, I was like, oh, is that a Hager? Cause I was like, oh, that would have been odd, you know, but it's, um, made in Portugal for us leisure products. And, um, this is eighties all day, but also this shape is awesome. It's great. And you could easily do like a little, like fairy garden or something, but a succulent garden would be so good in this. But yeah, I saw, I thought this was so cute. Um, but I, I just felt like that's something that somebody's definitely gonna, gonna like. And then, uh, this better not make me regret it. <laughs> um, I have not been doing well with all the earring trees lately, so I'm gonna give this one a shot. Even though it's a graduation owl, 
it's just so cute. It's cute because it's an owl. And so um, it doesn't say, I don't see Revere on there or, um, oh my gosh, the other brand. I can't think of the name right off my, off the top of my head. And it's neither one of those is on here. So um, anyhow, we'll see. I'll sell that. Hopefully I'll sell that. <laughs> All right. And then, oof. Uh, I got, now I got this for me, probably. I have gotten, I have one that I bought off of, um, I think I bought it off of Instagram. So, and I love it that it's the green, you know. Um, so then when I saw this and it was only, um, oh, it was $3.99. But then I got like, a, so it was $3 really because I got the discount. I, I paid probably, I don't know if I paid like 10 or 15. So, I thought I'll get this because yeah, worth it. Um, I got this and the reasoning for this is when I used to sell locally at a uh, occasional sale, um, I had, a I had a customer that went out of her mind when she saw that I had this something with this on it, the name. And it, it's um, Veuve Clicquot. And she's like, that's my favorite champagne. Oh, my God. And this thing has, like, never been used, I don't think. it's. It just says, imported by Moet, Hennessy, USA. Um, and it says, product of France. And yada, yada, yada. And um, so it's um, got the little thing there I don't know and um you unzip it and put whatever your thing in there right I guess your champagne and zip it up and then you would do that and you could carry it <laughs> so I thought well maybe there's somebody else out there whose favorite champagne is Vive Cliquet Vive Cliquet like, I don't know the difference between one champagne or the other, because what do I know? Um, or you might know somebody, and this would be a great gift. So, I don't know. Um, also, the color is really cool. So, I thought, what the heck. Let me put this up here. <laughs> and... Um, the color of the day was yellow and I only got one, two, three dang things that were yellow. So, and they were like a dollar. So they only, then they were 50. No, I know what they were. I'll show you when I get to them. Um, so this, I would have liked this just for the box because oh, there we go. But the box was a little damaged, but that was okay. But then you, when you open it and it still has the stuff, then that's great. This has never been nothing. So there's, it's, this is all vintage cards. Some of them are especially cute. <laughs> so I'm probably gonna, um, I don't know. I might just sell like the cards separately. I'm not sure. So. This is, um, it, it's not an Avon, although, um, people that don't know would probably go f think it is, but it says Royal Almond Bath Crystals, and this is by Jaffra. So, um, there it says Jaffra, but it's definitely, yes, it does look like it would have been an Avon thing, but no. So it's, but it definitely is going to go with what my intentions are. 
So then when I found this, I was I was really surprised because so I wish our Goodwill would just have a bag, a, a wall, a wall of bags, but they do bags on the ends of every um, on the, the ends of a lot of different rows at the at this one anyway not at all not at all of them um and then also they had it in like this big end cap that had like sections and so they just had it full of bags so um i found this i found these in there so i thought that was pretty good there would have been a time where i would have kept those <laughs> and then i got these okay so this is one of the things that uh, that was 99 cents and yellow, so it came down to 50 cents, which, you know, but I'm giving it to Jill because uh, next week um, her son is graduating from uh, college, or no, from med school, um, from med school, and so I'm having her take these, so, and... Then there's these that are um, blue poppy folded notes. And I think it just says there's 10 of the notes and then 10 envelopes to match. And I believe that this is probably a never been used. Usually stuff like this, there's one <clears throat> missing. But sometimes they've just never used any of them. So anyway... Um, that I, um, these I'll use, you know, for, in my, um, packages. I thought this was so pretty. Now, this isn't normally my jam, but I don't know. I just was like, you know what? I think it's going to be somebody's jam made in Japan and it's Moriyagi. It's got Moriyagi or some of you might say Moriage, but, um, it's so pretty. I love those little, the little handles <laughs> and I, I just thought it was so pretty. So there, take a look at that. That would just look so pretty. Just out, just that. So, um, uh, trying to stack the stuff without uh, having an avalanche of sorts. Okay, I got this for my mom. Well, actually, I got one for my mom already. And this one is for her friend. Because they both wanted one. A, ro a wooden... Uh, they both wanted a wooden rolling pin. And... Um, they, um, so I got, found one and then they said they would just share that one because they lived down the hall from each other. But then I found this one, so. And I see my mom. Well, you, you don't, it doesn't matter when I see mom. You're seeing this on a different day. Okay, so. Of course, I, my first taste of Avon was when I was a child. Because that was when it was, you know like huge with the the decanters and the things for children and um this like this is from 1970 I was four so yeah this is the kind of stuff that I had I didn't have this one that I remember anyway I had the Aristocats um I had you know, like other things that were just oh I had the small world girls which is what I collect but this is um, non tears shampoo, and it's it's lioness Linus for all you um, oh happiness is clean shiny hair. <laughs> so for those of you that are into the um, peanuts gang, there you go. It's not a, I mean I usually have stuff that's Snoopy, but uh, this is something a little different. And this, this is, like, when I first found this, 
I was like, is this even, this green is just a weird shade of green. So I don't know that they're necessarily vintage. I, that green, it looks like, um, what do you call that? Fertilizer green or something? I forget. I know that there's like a term for that or something, but, um, so yeah, I don't know. We'll see. Then I got these. Oh, see, and these were the other two yellow things. So the, all the three packs of the napkins that I got, they were nothing. They were 50 cents or 99 and then they were 50, 49. So these are, um, both, um, they are both, uh, 16 napkins and they are both, uh, the matching season's greetings. So I like it when I find, um, Christmas ones that are all the same because I like all different, but I know some people like it and don't like all that hodgepodge so that they might like it that there's, you know, all the same, but still vintage. So there's that. And I, I got these. Now I found two things of them and let me see if I can find the other one. Uh, Cause I'm pretty sure I bought both of them. Yeah. I, um, I cannot tell you for sure if I am, if somebody really wanted one, I would sell it to them. But otherwise, I would probably keep them both. So, yeah, I would definitely sell one of these. Um, but, yeah, here it is. I mean, I got two of them. <laughs> so, I, because this is what, first of all, it's got the thing still on it. That's awesome. But these old bathroom things, I love. I just think they're so, so dang cute. So, um, you know, <laughs> they're rubber. I, I don't know. Flexible vinyl plastic, never crimps, curls. N one piece construction, nothing to break or come apart. <laughs> so I love that. I found them in two different sections. So, um, I got, um, some cards. I think I only got these four. I'm pretty sure I got these. Cause I love, right? And I got, ah, dang it. I got to take this tag off cause it's over the design. Oh man, they have another sticker that was over it. Dang it. Target. Well, Target had two different price tags over it. Old, that's an old thing, you know, but I got, so I got these and I'll be honest, I think I don't even know if I got a full deck. I didn't care because I'm going to sell the cards. But I did see some other cards I wanted to get, but I couldn't find a full deck of them. And so I just grabbed some and put them. Oh, these are actually in really good shape for being real old. Um, Did I just drop one? Uh, where did it go? Oh, here. Um, but I thought, didn't I put them in here? Yes. So then I got <laughs> these and I just shoved them in there because they were, there were not enough to make a deck. And I'm like, no, am I, I'm not, they're not gonna sell them like this or well, whatever. It would have been ridiculous. So there's just enough for me to sell a few of them. <laughs> little kitties and um yeah and so like these I I'm not sure how I'll sell them because I've had these before and I think I might actually keep one this deck because that's a boho deck and I think I sold them before I will definitely have these for you because um well again I don't know if I'll take take the packages apart 
or not yet. I don't know yet. Um, and then these, which were already apart. Um, the paper had been already apart, or the plastic. Look how pretty. And um, but the the pack had burst open. It hadn't. It wasn't um, rubber banded together. So I found a rubber band that was on something else that didn't need it. And I put it on here so they could see that it was really a new deck. I don't really need that though. Um, but yeah, these are brand new. And I just was like, oh, I'm going to sell these separately anyway, I think. I think they're so pretty. And I, so I didn't even count them again. I, I thought that was, those are really pretty. I didn't count them because, um, it didn't matter to me. You know, a couple few cards isn't gonna kill me. So anyway, um, got this other Avon. Now this one I am on the fence about. I think I might sell this one. The box is perfection. I love the box. I love the colors on the box. I love this. It's called Hearts and Flowers Fragrance Candle. Yeah, it's a candle. And um, and it's it's um, like a lot of milk, like a lot of uh, things with um, Avon. It's milk glass. It needs to be wiped off because it's um, probably was out for decor and got dirty. But I, it's so cute. And I mean, you can kind of smell it, but there's the candle still. So I don't know if I'm going to keep this or not. I just, I, I cannot tell, <laughs> I can't tell yet. If somebody wants it bad enough and they say something to me, then I'll absolutely sell it. But, um, yeah, I don't, I don't know yet. Like I said, if somebody wants it and asks me, then I'm going to sell it to them. Um, then this. So this is like one of the first things I saw before I noticed all oh, there was so many. Um, and they had like other kinds of soaps. Now the bummer of it was they had two different lemon velvet ones, but like I won't, I don't, I didn't, the prices were too high for some of them. And I, I couldn't sell them. And they were, I don't know, but these, I wasn't going to get them. But then when I opened the box, so this is the box. And I was like, oh, and I thought they were just going to be like in the, you know, like the mold of the soap, but no, look at that. So then I saw that and I was like, oh man, I got to get those. Somebody's going to love those. So I got them because I love you guys. And uh, yeah, but the so the lemons were just partial. Like they're just, they weren't. That wasn't exciting, you know what I mean? So, um, I got this, um, that I think I'll make like a little, like a little bag of, oh, this is guaranteed by good housekeeping. <laughs> a little placemat, little hot pad thing. Um, I, uh, I would keep it if it was, if it was a different color, but or this would go with my old kitchen. <laughs> um, you could also use it under a pillow or a, a pillow, what? a candle. <laughs> um, maybe I'll make like a little kitchen packet. I don't know. We'll just see, but that's cute. I like these things. I grew up using them. So, oh yeah, I got this. Um, I don't know why, because you guys haven't really been into the buying the purses, but I think I might have a purse sale. Because I got, I got a couple today at this, at this day. This is a sack. Lay sack. The sack. I'm sorry. It's the sack. And it's a smaller one. So, really good for running around um, in the summer. Or, you know, like, definitely in the summer. But, like, for flea marketing or um, rummage sailing, you know. Just have one little, you know, probably sling a uh, cross crossbody and then I found this one and um it was a no-brainer but um now this the funny thing is they moved some of the purses 
and these were over in a new location, but not, not where they, then they still had the other purses where they would normally be. So I just thought it was really weird. Um, okay, this is, they didn't do this right. <laughs> Here we, no, oh, let me do this. They didn't um, latch this properly. Um, so, no, that would... Go like that. I can't get it. I can't get it. I will have to figure it out. Well, maybe that's right after all. I don't know. Oh, yeah. Well, maybe it is. I'm not. I'm not so sure that I know better. But yeah, I think I just don't. Yeah, <laughs> that, that thing is upside down. Anyway, I'll fix it. Anyhow, that's upside down. <laughs> so there's a little pouch right there. But then there's also the zipper open there. And I think, no, I don't think I had this. I think I wanted to buy this in a bigger one, but it the, the arm was ruined, maybe. Or did I have it and you guys didn't buy it and I was shocked. I don't remember. But, um, and then the inside, it's pink. And just, you know, I've got an inside pocket and a snap closure. It is Lily Bloom. And it's the cats, you guys. Look at the cute kitties. And it's the kind that is a fantastic crossbody. I mean, this is such a good crossbody because it is long. Long, long, long. Let's see. Well, I can't. I did it the wrong way. It's supposed to be the other way. Anyway, you guys know what I'm talking about. So, yay. So cute. I was pretty stoked about that. Then I got this um, for art. Art. Arting. I gave one to, or I bought one recently and I gave it to um, Danny. So then I'll just take this one and keep it got this cutie 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 put to tea and it I'll just need to get that stuff off of there and there you go little bird of something <laughs> but oh, it's so cute with the blue and or the green and white I like that a whole lot it's different it's not broken or anything. It's adorable. And it has eyes. <laughs> one is rolling. It looks like one's up and one's down. <laughs> Whatever. So cute. Um, I got these because I think I'm going to use them as a giveaway. But... I'm not sure about this one because I really like it. So I think I might keep this one. And then this is actually, these three are Mary Engelbright. And then the bottom one is the Marriage Marjolene. Oh, no, it's not. This one is not. This one's different. Oh, no, it isn't. It is. It's um, Sue Zipkin by Studio 18. Okay, which is that. And that's also what this is. So I might keep this one. I'm not sure. Otherwise, you guys, look at the one. It's got little Scotty dogs on it. And the one has cherries. And then hearts and flowers. And then little, um, just flowers on it, I think. And then this one is, um, just, uh, leaves. So... I'm not sure how I'm going to do that yet, but yeah, that's the plan. Um, I, got, I got these. They're 99 cents. They were, they were 
in one of the baggies and those are for me these this one is it's a uh, um speckled so i'm gonna have to check that out i don't know but um i i have a thing of dice that i kind of basically collect so and then I found these. Now, I I was digging around. It's like it was in the craft section. And I found these, and it was a bag of them. Of these keys on a um, keychain. And it says, the key to happiness is, the, is love and the ability to open a bottle. So this is actually a, a bottle opener. Let's see? on the end there and um this has one two three four five six seven eight i think ten or ten or twelve in this bag that i got and then so i was like oh i'm gonna get those and then i saw another one i was like oh i should get that and then i saw more and more and more and i'm like okay forget it now and there's too many i can't you know so i just got one bag of them thought that was cool so i'll put some on with you guys if you want them and otherwise then they'll just go to my um my flea market sale and then um i got these and i don't even want the bean the beads inside so um although this one has like oh no yeah um i might put them in a different little thing and um because i'm gonna do like a little buy it like a little like um bag of material things like materials and whatnot so i mean is it a lot for what i got yes because it's dumb but not to me maybe for this one i didn't really need this one but i really like this one but then this one had the lid although i could have swapped them i suppose anyhow it's um blue bonnet margarine and so I just wanted those. I really want that white one that has that one white one with the different colored flowers. But anyhow, these are the last two things of, uh, of that haul. So yeah, um, two big days in a row. Hey, okay? um, let me know what was your favorite thing and what you're interested in, in, you know, trying to get or whatever, you know? And, uh, yeah, what do you think about Avon? <laughs> so, um, that's it. I will, uh, see you tomorrow at my sale. And, uh, several of these items will be in the sale for sure. And, um, and more. <laughs> so, uh, like I said, hope to see you tomorrow. Bye, everybody.